if you look in the uh, in the community chat, for some reason, my, can you see my name in like pink? Uh, I see it in green. You see it in green? Okay. I see it in pink because it's mine, I guess. Did you put 12 slots in? Okay, there, there it goes. Let's see there we go. Controls. So the planet, the one planet is smashable, but you need five, um, five thrusters, and I think I think that's quite a bit. I mean, I, if it's not a lot, then I might add six or seven or something. I want it to be smashable, but with a lot of effort. And then there's a metal planet, which you know, obviously, you can, uh, you know. But they're big planets, and if there's a lot of teams on, hopefully nobody will be able to get off a um, some kind of smash for a long time. Let me check if it should be showing up in the lobby. I should be able to see it. What does it say the region is insomnia server, you said or Yeah. Um ah oh shit. I crashed out of PA. Fuck. Should say Insomnia Cult for the region. Um, the name of the lobby should be 12 player game with the cult. Region Custom Insomnia Cult. Custom Insomnia Cult, so it's three words? Yeah. Should be able to see it in the lobby unless he isn't playing Titans, I guess. You should be able to see like all games. He sent me a uh, friend request. Try and well, yeah, he, he's there. he's playing Titans. He's even ranked on one v one. He's ranked uh, the the lowest rank one be below me. I'm silver. He's whatever. Yeah, I guess try inviting him. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. So okay, so now I have him on my friend list. So I guess that I can like start spamming friend invites to these people and then when I have them on my friend list, I can start spamming um Well, uh, I am going to add some AI, just so that it looks good from outside. Are you trying to stream again? Uh, I'm already streaming. Okay. The thing is, we're paying for this too. <laughs> yeah. So if it takes an hour to start. 
So, do you have any luck looking for the dedicated servers? I just, I, I'm just wondering how much it would cost. How uh, much more? Normally, I see them going up for like a hundred a month. So a hundred like, a month means that you have them twenty four seven. Yeah. They don't uh, rent them by the hour. I haven't seen anybody renting it by the hour. Usually do a monthly thing. A hundred a month for is that like medium level hardware? Um. Yeah, something like that. I would have to compare what the processors are. But you're usually getting like four cores. And then at most like eight gigs of RAM. How much would that thing cost to buy? Um let's see quite a bit. <laughs> I mean, it's it's just pretty much a normal computer. You don't need a graphics card, do you? Yeah, you wouldn't need one. You know what I'm thinking? At the end of the day, we can just play with AI. I wonder uh, if there's a huge difference to... I think AI probably spends more resources because it has to calculate the AI instead of people just, right? Yeah, possibly. So that's what I'm saying. I mean, if you want to pay all that money, you want to make sure that you're getting at least much better performance than you get for free. Yeah. You don't want to get a worse server. Yeah. I want to see what kind of hardware Danjiro could get his hands on. Uh, another option we could do is we could get a virtual dedicated server. Those go for cheaper. What does that mean virtual dedicated? It's like um, an Xbox. It's uh... It's still, it's a virtual machine, but... It uses... Uh, shared res... It uses uh... Allocated resources that's dedicated to it the thing is are we gonna get our own core um, you know, because because if we want to take advantage of the multi-threading we need at least two cores to ourselves yeah, I think um, I think I saw some that had hyper threading on it so the virtual dedicated server is kinda like what we're using now Well, uh, later tonight, after I log off, maybe you can take like 10 minutes to um, post in the forum a little how-to. Or maybe don't post in the forum, email it to me if you can. And then tomorrow, when you're not online, I'm going to try to start the server on my own. Okay. And if I get stuck anywhere, I will have time to ask you before Saturday. All right. How many steps is it? Like, do this, do that, do that. How many, what is it? 10 steps, 20? Um... Right now, I loaded it off the image, so had to. I had to go on to Amazon, uh, launch launch the image that I had saved. Uh, make sure I put in the right security protocol. Um, after that, I needed to log in using a terminal. Uh, change the IP address to what we were assigned and then you pretty much launch it after that Doesn't sound too bad. Yeah, it's not too bad, but if you want to do it from scratch, that's a lot more steps That is huh? Yeah. Why would you want to do it for, from scratch? So is there any advantage? No, Uh, not really Just if you want to know how to do that But I I have all the directions saved from the last time, so I could just send you that. So,
I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna send friend requests to everybody that I play with on 1v1 uh, Uh, when I uh, remember how many people there were and how easy it was to fill a lobby and all that if I knew how things were gonna go I would just play a lot more back then the thing is there's nothing else to play so I looked at that game uh, what's it called um, Ashes of the Singularity, and it looks horrible. <laughs> it looks horrible. Like they don't seem to have any buildings. Every video I've seen is just a mass of ugly units. What? Look, uh, he, he posted three messages. I'm trying to explain to him why. I guess I have the bot so people will join. It doesn't make much sense if you don't know what I'm saying. Anyway, okay, I will remove the bots then. It's the same business as last time. If nobody had left, we would have like seven, eight people by now. Yeah. There's no way to explain it to them. It's just... If I could afford a 24-7 server, I would leave it on 24-7 but locked. So that... Uh, and I would po probably put the name of the server to like www.culture.vg <laughs> and then people 24-7 they would see the server sitting there and then okay you advertise the site so they go there and they check and then uh, when you do play it would be an event for them, I guess, because they would have seen the server, of, you know, uh, was waiting there for so long, and then suddenly the server is live, and they would want to check it out. So I'm wondering, you know, uh, you think like with a thousand US, you buy a good server? Yeah, possibly. I'd have to look at the prices for server and then, hardware. Uh, you know what? I have a 300 megabyte connection upload in my home. Isn't that good enough? Yeah. <laughs> it's not. It's not. It's not good enough, I guess, for us because I'm in the Canary Islands. I mean, even for Europe, that's not very good. It's like as far away from Europe as you can get. Uh, but for PA, I don't think that will be a problem. I am actually in the Atlantic, so I'm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm as far to the west of Europe as you can get. On the other hand, you know, if I was going to spend a thousand on a computer right now, I would get, you know, a computer with a, 10, a 1070 on it. So I could play like VR games and stuff like that. I don't know. We'll see. I'm paying. 60 euros a month on internet. Damn. It's about $70, you know, so I might as well use it. Well, 
Well, uh, we want to test our server. And this isn't filling up, so I don't know, maybe we'll just tell the guy that... Somebody enter. Oh, oh there's oh, more geez. people. This guy is from yesterday. Yeah. Steam is a guy from yesterday, and he has so uh, he has a lot of. I think he's in. The, let me see if he's on the PA server right now. Uh, no, I can't see him there. Although some of them use uh, several names. There you go. It's filling up now. Mind if I spectate? Fucking hell! <laughs> you get spectate in game. <laughs> Today he. Uh Okay, there we go. Always Prime is uh, okay. Looking for PAC. Basically, now all these people are coming now are from the uh, PA community thing. Maybe they just finished the game. I can actually see them in their uh, channel. Cool. Okay, nice. we're gonna play then. Should I add one more team? Okay, there we go. I'm gonna add one more team. Okay, now some people left. Very more slots. <laughs> I think I think we shouldn't push it further than 14. What do you think? Yeah, I think this will be good. Let's not push it. Yeah, let's just play like this. We just need one, two, three people. We should be able to get them. Oh, 
Oh, that one guy left. He said he was gonna invite his friend. Yeah. Well, on the other hand, we got the uh, the cool guys. These are the cool guys. The way I see it, these are the good. Get rid of team two. He came no, back. Okay, it's back here. Yeah. We're getting there. And now I'll open another team. Now we have, except like we're just missing one guy. Unless that guy wants to be on his own. I don't care what he wants. <laughs> There's a slot there. <laughs> we're gonna play, man. See? You just have to, well, be like, I guess. As long as you're willing to wait and you have like you can open another window like the economist or something you know if you're not paying for the uh, you know for the server and you have a few hours ahead of you I'd rather just wait 10 minutes than play l l smaller games Well, at, at least we're definitely, uh, you know, testing the freaking server. Now we're going to learn the truth about this $2 server. Yeah. There, there we, we go. go. So, so we're waiting for this guy, uh, Alakazam. Alakazam. Okay, Oops, he's back. He just read it up, so. One more. guy has a potato. <laughs> there we go. Come on. Come on. Get ready. Yes. I was half expecting yes. him to, to quit. <laughs> I was half expecting him to quit. <laughs> Okay, so we can only go on this planet, and uh, okay, we got two spots. Is it two spots or one spot? One spot. One spot. Yeah, because there's all these teams. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna rush. Orbital. Uh, okay, yeah. Put your uh, commander there, and we're gonna rush orbital. Okay, I'm right here. And uh, okay. 
And we're gonna go. We're gonna go to the um, the Jot Jotunheim, the uh, Red Planet. Uh, or we could go to you. You see, you see how much metal they have. Uh, but I think they, the other guys might be fighting over the metal planet, so maybe we can leave them do that. What do you think? And just try to get the metal from the red planet. That'd be no, fun. no planet is gonna be empty. Yeah. But uh, I think we have more chances of having fewer people in uh, the red planet, and yeah. we can go faster uh, than everybody, anybody else there, with my with my plan, basically. You, you're gonna have to give me your commander. All right. Um, we basically abandoned completely this planet, and just try to dominate in the red one, and then see what happens. It's freaking seven teams. It's like it's gonna be chaos. <laughs> yeah. Almost everybody's ready. Well, so so far the the server is doing okay. So um, we don't farm anything. We immediately go for a boat factory. I'll do that. Go for a boat factory, and then. Uh, Wait. And then that's gonna make just one uh, Faber because that's the only way to make the orbital. And then, uh, let me see. I'm rushing the, fab the Faber. There he is. And now I'm starting the orbital factory right there. And then I'm queuing one orbital fabricator. Uh, yeah, I'm queuing one orbital fabricator, and I'm going to the. Um, I'm gonna find a nice spot in the other planet. Let me see. Okay, I found it. And I'm sending that uh, shift to. Okay. Uh, okay. Now I'm shutting down the other factory. Okay, and now I'm rushing the uh, orbital thingy. There's no metal, but look, after the orbital fiber leaves, all these dudes are yours. Okay. And your job is to put up a, uh, to, uh, to, to put up a uh, portal, and put up a portal and uh, some uh, energy. So put one or two commanders, stop them. Uh, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to shut down the, uh, the orbital factory. We don't need it. You you need to put down the portal and you need to make sure we have energy. All right, energy is positive. And uh, okay, I'm looking at where it's going. It's gonna take a while. Uh, yeah, start production as well. Then afterwards, uh, whatever you can produce of value. Actually, you know what would be a value? Um, some orbital stuff. Maybe another, um, a couple of Avengers and maybe a couple more. Um, but I turn off the factory, so you have to turn on again. All right. Um, I can see they're going in orbit too. See, uh, yeah. Oh, it's gonna take forever for us. Our. Uh oh, okay. I hadn't planned for this. <laughs> Basically, what's happening? Uh, I'll tell you. I explained to you what's ha happening. What I wanted was, I wanted. Um, so yeah, I start start building up there normally as you would do, and uh, I'm gonna try to help. So make okay. so make uh you know bases in the water as well. All right, portals right there. Uh, I'll explain to you what happened. I should have put the two other planets orbiting around our planet as a moon, uh, but I put yeah. them orb I I put them in their own orbits. So that's gonna mean that means you have to have a lot of um, I don't remember what they're called. Uh, it's called like. I got some um, Avengers up. Okay. We don't need too many. Then after what? See, they're moving too. And they're trying to go to the... I think they're going to the other, to the... Yeah. Uh, the, the reason that I didn't put them as moons is because I couldn't figure out in the system designer how to put them on moons. But anyway, we arrived in the... We're now in the... Uh, let me see. 
Yep, we're now there. Um, I'm putting the portal down. Make sure we're positive. Yeah, we are positive. Uh, put down maybe one more. Uh, Uh, do you have a teleporter up? Yeah, I linked, uh, put some units through. Okay. I'm gonna put the commander through. And I'm gonna put your, uh, fabrics that are waiting there. Are you gonna take both commanders? Yeah, I would prefer to take both. I would prefer to take whatever you can send. Alright, uh... Okay, just, they're coming through. One. Okay. First time I've heard of this arriving a new biome. Okay. Okay, I shut off the portal. Great, great. Um, it's gonna need naval units here. Yeah, do your best there. I don't think you're gonna get far, and uh, we have to decide whether it's better for you to just abandon there and come here. That's one thing we have to decide. Uh. For the time being, it's okay, but uh, because I can still, there's still not much stuff here, so I can still run everything. Okay. Okay, I made some mistakes, but... Oh, they have an Avenger here. Um, are you sending the Avengers to me? No, you're not. Uh, ping them. Uh, okay, I see where you're at. Here. Send them. Yeah, okay, the good dude is coming. I'm gonna try to put an umbrella to get rid of him. Okay. Although of course the Avengers are we're crashing, we're crashing on energy. Maybe you should just uh, stop doing whatever you're doing there and come here, man. Because I see two Avengers is not looking good. Three Avengers now. Uh, although I'm putting an umbrella, but it's taking forever because our economy is tanking. So, all right. Uh, at, le at least I'm grabbing a lot of metal now. So that's something. Uh, Yeah, they have quite a few. I think the best way to defeat their Avengers now is just put some uh, umbrellas up. Because I just don't see us getting anything in space with uh, these Avengers over my head. Um, at least the, the, the metal problem is going to be solved very quickly because I have a ton of people making uh, getting metal here. Okay, I got two of his Avengers with uh, the first um, umbrella and now I'm going to put another one. They have a long, uh, they have a quite good range of these umbrellas. So, and we have a lot of energy now. It's looking good. Uh, I don't know. How are you doing over there? You think you could? Uh, uh, you yeah, I'd prefer to build here. Okay, do that then. Yeah, look at all this metal we have. We're gonna, we have to start building now. Um, And uh, yeah, there's no reason to wait uh, to to not go T2. So I'm gonna put a T2 vehicle factory down. Energy is looking great. I'm gonna have a second umbrella soon. Oh, and your uh, Avengers arrived. Three, four arrived. Oh my god, look at this uh, economy! Um, <laughs> okay, I have to put down... Uh, I'm gonna put down one third umbrella. Yep. 
And of course, uh, I have units now, but how am I going to send them to you? They're land units. Uh, you could send them here. If you could get a few of them, there's a giant continent near me, and there's guys really? on Really? Yeah. Okay, uh, well, we I have a portal. If you can connect a portal to that continent to me, I could send you some units. Uh, of course, I don't yeah. want to lose the game like last time. Just send me some right now. It'll help. Okay. Okay. I'm sending a bunch. In the meantime, uh, okay, I'm gonna start some air factories at least, I guess. Oh my god, I really have to put up more factories. Oh my god, so much metal I'm getting here. Um have to rump up things. How are you doing with those units I send you? I'm seeing if they get across this little bridge that's here. I have two factories making vehicles just for you. Oh yes, they get across. Yeah, I, I try to make it so that um, so that you could play a, a ground game too on that planet. Not a very good ground game, but oh shit, they got navies. They got navy. Of course, they got navies. Yeah. Okay, we're tanking on energy, that's uh, bad. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get wiped out here. You are? Okay, um, maybe send the units back? Of course you can't now because uh, you don't have energy. I you still have, have left, uh, I still have orbital here. I don't think they, w I don't think this team went orbital. Doesn't maybe you like can, uh, you can uh, harass them with orbital. I think it would be best to just come here and help me. Salvage whatever you have to send over and just uh, come and help me. Because, oh, we, yeah, I think we have the entire. Well, we have maybe half the planet at least. Um, if we could still. Might still be able to get a foothold here. Let's stick clear up. Okay, well, uh, fair enough. I need to solve the energy problem. Uh, I'm trying, I'm doing it. Well, I, I'm making two T2 factories at the same time, that's the problem. We have tons of metal, so now the problem is the energy. I really have to make, okay. One of the T2 factories is gonna go online now, so that's gonna bring down the energy. Great. Okay. Fuck. All right, they're taking out my orbital. I'm gonna try to keep these orbital fabers here. You have orbital fabers there? Yeah. Okay. Um, maybe you can find some other place in the planet to get a foothold, but I don't think so. There, there's gonna be. Okay, now we have some T2 uh, ground units. And okay, energy problem solved. I have to go orbital here. I have to make an orbital factory. Uh. Maybe I should just send you one orbital f faber here. I'll send you one. Oh, somebody's already dead. Well, uh, it's not it's not a uh surprise considering you know, it's it's such a huge game all these people. Okay, I dropped the ball a little bit on the fabers. Seems like the water planet's pretty filled up. 
And they're gone. Don't have anything Whoa. over there now. What is this stop that he's saying? I have no idea what he's talking about. So, okay, uh, maybe you have to come back here because I'm getting under fire and uh, there, there's going to be a war on this planet. And yeah. it would be best if you uh, if you play the units. So I can concentrate. Okay, oh my god, look at this economy. And I'm just wasting it. I'm totally wasting it. Are you back here? Yeah, I'm controlling okay. the units. Okay, great, great. There's various fronts. Uh, make sure you... Um, and I have an Air Force in the center of the base you can check. Mostly with anti-air, mo mostly with fighters though. Make sure you... Uh, okay, now we're uh, on space two. I really need T2 energy for fuck's sake. Well, so far, uh, the server's running fine. Yeah. 14 people, 3 planets. That's been good. Okay, finally, finally, I can make T2 energy. Let me know what kind of units you need. Okay, now we are in uh, in space. Uh, I'm not going to start an orbital factory though because uh, that takes a lot of energy and we still have energy problems. But soon enough, soon enough, I should be able to. Okay, now we have another T2 Faber. Uh, it's going to help with the energy. Okay. Uh, if you could build an advanced radar, that'd be cool. Advanced radar? Is that the one on the in space, you mean? No. No. You yep. mean the T3? Oh, I totally fixed the energy problem. Yeah, I'm building an advanced radar now. Uh, I totally fixed the energy problem with the... Uh, and I'm just gonna keep doing that. Okay, and now I'm gonna start spamming. Uh, okay, first of all, uh, we need orbital factories. Yeah, of course we do. We have no idea what's happening in the metal planet. Uh, we're just ho I'm just hoping that the other guys will take care of it, but... Uh, I'm gonna s uh, make an orbital factory and we're gonna start sending... Uh, Avengers and stuff to the... Um, how are we doing this planet? Are we... Uh, we we might be able to take it. Let me put down... Okay, I'm gonna put down another T2 vehicle factory. Shit. Oh, you got a commander here. That's gonna be tougher than I thought. Do they have any T2? Yeah, they have T2 set up. They have more than us, they have a lot. I don't think they... Yeah, they have more than us right now. Really? Oh, but okay. It's not, it's not too much. I should be able to rush him. Well, uh... I'm building a ton of uh, T2 vehicle factory. I could build a Titan as well, probably. If you can, that'd be helpful. I just need some fast units. If you could make a T2 need bot factory. So it's like everything uh, T2 you could do. Yeah, that's what I'm doing, but I'm not doing any any uh, bot factories because I can see some T2 units of ours just sitting there. All right, I and grab them. here. Okay. Yeah, 
So you want bot? Oh, okay, I will try uh, because I have made no bot factories at all. You see, so I will make some bots then. Although definitely running out of space on this planet. Yeah, it's... Yeah, I think we have enough for a Titan. Right now... Well, not right now. Uh, not now, yeah. I don't know what happened. Um... The metal is the problem, it's falling like flies. Um, that's because I haven't upgraded it, so I'm gonna start upgrading now. Oh, See, it was the we energy have, that we was have, the We have a nuke going on right now. We have what? Oh shit. I thought I was building a radar. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, yeah, so I have to put more people on... Uh, yeah, and you know what else I'm gonna do? What I haven't done since the beginning. Oh, you build another radar? Why are you building another T2 radar? T2 radar? I already have one. Oh, right you already have one? It. Okay, cool. Yeah. Back. Okay. Uh, if you need something to build, it's better to tell me. Um, yeah. Oh, that's why we crashed. Yeah, that's. I accidentally made it. Okay, do you want the Aris? Do you know what the Aris is? The rolling fortress near invisible long range? Um, I'd rather have a Zeus. I just need mobility right now. Oh, where, where do I make the Zeus in? Is it in the T2 air factory? Yeah, you can also use the orbital fabbers. They can to build all Zeus? three, yeah. Oh, I see, okay. Okay, Zeus then. I'm starting it up. Shit. They're pushing with their army. Uh, I wonder how I could help. Um, okay, first of all, we do have the economy, so I'm gonna... All my orbital fibers are gonna rush the, uh, the, zo the Zeus. And I have a bunch of... If I knew where the war was happening... Uh, Oh yeah, okay. fuck! His commander's in the sky. What? I could, I could use the Avengers. Okay, take the Avengers then. Um. In the meantime. Fuck! He already left. Yeah, the uh, this is not gonna be long. Of course. Okay. Do I have anybody doing energy at all? Yeah, they're coming. It's not much. I think they're abandoning this place. It's not even the guy that I was fighting before, it's another guy. The Zeus is ready, dude. Almost ready. Nice. You know where it is? It's right here. Nice. Okay, Got and it. I'm gonna make another one. Oh, they're not gonna know what's gonna hit him. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It moves so fast. It's very useful on a big planet. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna repair that factory. 
And the second one is at 30%. Think you could get an orbital factory up? I have an orbital factory. Is it already there? Oh, yeah, nice. it's been going for a while. No, I mean uh, one, uh, one in the sky. Oh, there it is. I didn't see it. Yeah. Dude, I'm making so many uh, upgrades, and we're still tanking the economy. I guess. Oh, and the second Zeus is gonna be up soon, dude. Nice. Love these things. <laughs> I hear the sound from the other side of the planet. <laughs> Zapping stuff. I'm gonna turn off one of the um, level 3 uh, radars because why not? Okay, uh, new Zeus, you got it. Okay, and I'm starting a new one. Yeah. Look, I'm gonna have to put some of these. Avengers on patrol. I see some orbital units heading up on us. I'm starting another uh, orbital factory, and I in this one I'm gonna make the radar because I want to send it to the other uh, to the other planets to see what the fuck's going on. If you can make a uh, shit, what? They got orbital units. Okay, okay. I'm uh, gonna need, need some orbital defense. Defense? Uh, don't you just need Avengers? Yeah. Fuck, I should be making more. I, uh, the, the economy can handle it. Uh, I'm putting more orbital factories up. Definitely need more Avengers. Yeah, I'm gonna go full Avengers now. Jesus. Uh... Okay, it's all clear. Should be able to clear them out of here. You'll be able to clear them out of this planet? Yeah. I just... Whoa, fuck. Catalyst. Yeah. Yeah, they're building it. I can see they're building it. It's the red guy. Uh, we're gonna have to invade the planet. I don't know if anybody else can invade the planet. There's... There's three more armies left. No, how how do I how do I uh, talk to everybody? I'm just talking to you now. I want to type to everybody. Shift just enter. Team. Oh. Um. Can we send all our uh, orbital forces to the metal planet right now? Or do you need them? Whoa, somebody's oh, oh. got the laser. Oh, he got the laser. Oh, look at it. Oh, that's us. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, they got one up in 30 minutes. He said shift and what to, to talk to everybody? Enter, shift, shift enter. I'm pressing and it still says team. Shift enter? Hold okay, down yeah, yeah, shift enter. How do I keep spectating now? Uh, Just hit review, review no. yeah. Yeah, no, people left him there. Look, if I had made that planet a normal planet, we would still be playing.
<laughs> oh, it's already dead. <laughs> I blew it up so fast. Yeah, damn, they just took over the metal planet. Yeah, it was... Well, you know what? We could have gone to the metal planet instead of the red planet. Yeah. Although more people went there. Yeah, it, it takes time to get there. I should have made... If I made the planets the way... Uh, just to orbit like a moon. Okay, let me go back and see if I can get the uh, the server now. I would really hate it if other people have the server. I guess we can always just shut it down and start it again, right? Yeah. But as long as there are people in there, we won't be able to see the server, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm not seeing it. I could just reset it right now. Uh, are they still playing? No, it finished. Once he had the laser, he just blew up everything. How, uh, how much time does it take to reset it? Uh, it should be pretty quick. Go ahead then. Alright, should be back up. There we go. Do, do you see it? Yeah, I'm uh, joining. I'm in. All right. I'm, I'm gonna leave in. so you could be the host. Okay, but wait until I'm in first. Yeah, I saw you in. Okay, okay. Just uh, need to put it to public. Oh, it's prime. Wait, so why can I only see it in you? Um, it's think cool though. That's we got in at the same time, so. I guess it didn't register. Got it. So what's well, uh, no problems with um. Yeah, I ran smooth so far. Although I don't know if we had just kept playing. Who knows? And look how many units! Like, look at the the metal planet, man. Yeah, it was full. I mean, usually it just slows down when you get that many. And we don't even have a dedicated server. This guy doesn't want to share army. I can do it, uh, I can get requests. Whoever wants shared army, I'll give you shared army and whoever... See the thing is, if people have a good time once, then they keep you when they see your server, they keep coming. So I'm thinking same system. Um How many systems have you made so far? I made three. I made um Elysium 2 and 3, which is a single big planet, just different radiuses, and this one, the Norse. So, I should have made more, but I didn't know what I have. Now I know better what I need. I need to study somewhere to find how to put moons, basically. That's what I don't know, how to put moons. Um, but I mean, for a change, we might as well, let me see, let's go for the 1300 system this time. All right. We want to stress the server, so there you go. Well, yeah. What's Crag? It was you one of the have... competitive maps. Oh.
Oh, Genki is the guy from our. Uh, he's he's in our Discord. Maybe you should open some spectator slots. People want to watch. Uh, you could p turn on five. You think that's a good idea? Yeah, I mean, some people want to check it out, so I guess we should let them. See what we can stress it. Anyway, if we want, like, casters on, they're going to have to be spectators. <coughs> yeah, but right, <coughs> right now, hold on, somebody messaged me. So I think Ojira is coming on now. In which case, we could do a 3v whatever. So now we can have uh, three. Uh, what's up, man? Yeah. Eight. What's up? So uh, fire up the game as soon as you can. Uh, we can have, I think, three, um, five teams or five teams of three players each. That's fifteen. If we can get fifteen. All right. But uh, fire up the game because, uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, I've got the game running. Uh, where, where do I go to join you guys? Okay, okay. Go to the uh, multiplayer, right? Custom multiplayer, whatever it's called, and then you should be able to see our game. It's called 14-player game with a cult. 15-player game with a cult. Um, yeah, 14-player with cult. I see it. Uh, join game. Oh, okay. Uh, Kojiro, you're gonna have to. Uh, yeah. You're gonna have to exit the game. You're gonna have to go to the top, bottom right of the screen. Uh, and then, one uh, second. Uh, it's go uh, to friend list. It's stuck in the load. Yeah, screen. I know. No, you're gonna have That's to, not good. It's gonna yeah, take a little like... bit. Change display name. Can mm -hmm. you find that? And then you have to add the client tag, call, to, and then you have to restart the game. So go okay. back to the main menu. Yeah. Going into you main see menu. the change display menu? The, the change display name thing? Do you see it? Uh, I'm looking for it. Where is it again? I'm sorry. Uh, uh, at the bottom right of the screen is your friend list. If you click, there's uh, a, a friend it. icon. And then if yeah. you click that, you will see Kojiro at the top. And if you click yep. on that, uh, it says change display name. And you're yep. going to have to copy paste your name from Steam. Go out to Steam, oh. copy paste the name there. And then you're gonna have to shut down the game and start it again, so you can get okay. the contact. Okay. Uh... Okay, I'm exiting. Great, great. I got the, your friend request too. And restarting. Okay. Uh, do you see now in the main menu the client tag and your name? Uh, the main menu. 
Yeah, actually it said that... Yeah, it said or... Before. Top left, yes, called Kojiro, yep. Okay, okay, you should be able to get it now, so come find us again in the multiplayer lobby. Yep. Okay, 15 player game with a cult. Join game. There we go, there we go. And then okay. now you cannot do anything while the, you're loading. You can see on the on the right of your screen, uh, your, it says building planets. When that Oops. finishes... Oh, what happened? Okay. I accidentally clicked the oh. slot. When that finished, right, oh, change yeah. your uh, change the, um, your commander. You've already changed it uh, because three of them are really ugly and we don't want them. But you picked one that's not <laughs> ugly, so that's fine. All right. <laughs> yeah. So normally the, you can get ten players maximum, but we're playing on our server now on Amazon, and you can I have see. as many players as you want. So we're, so we're we just played a fourteen-player game. It, was, it went really well, and now huh. we're trying fifteen. Okay. Before it was fourteen players with seven teams because it was 2v2v2v2 2v2 2v2. now that you came in it can be 3v3 you see mm -hmm. yeah okay so uh i must be learning this game but uh, is there anything i should know before going in uh pfft, yeah hold on because it's a bit of a chaos like orange is gonna win what are the guys saying uh they want me to close the slot Let me ask them. This guy always prime is... Uh... We have all the coolest guys basically on the game right now. Like these are guys with like 2000 hours and they're on Discord every day and they're they play uh. small little tournaments, so all these guys always prime, looking for PA students. Um, yeah, at least yeah. these two guys are definitely big time, whatever. I see them in their Discord channel. <laughs> <laughs> so, look. It's... It's fucked up. It's extremely complicated. Um, even my, even I, like, I find myself, like, spending half the game just staring at the screen, trying to decide what to do next. <laughs> but, uh, and, and this game is just crazy. But we do have a couple of good strategies. Because okay. I made the, pl uh, actually, yeah, I made the planet and, uh... So, basically, what you're gonna do is you're gonna, um, uh, control our armies. Because it's the easiest thing to do. Okay. All you're doing basically is you're making a little box or a circle and you're selecting like any, like in any other RTS you're selecting all the units and you're moving them around the map and uh -huh. um, I'm gonna be making the base and recall is gonna be uh, doing something a bit more complicated than you he's gonna be trying to get all the metal nodes huh. okay. and defending them you know uh, putting whatever uh, so you just have to. There's three. Uh, there's four types of units, uh, but you're gonna have to worry about three of them. There's uh, boats, there's uh, vehicles, and there's aircraft. Okay. So um, the boats are good because they can move fast, and this is a big planet, so we're gonna need boats. They can move fast. The the vehicles are good because they they have they have more power than the than the boats. Hmm. And then you cannot take down a a vehicle army with just boats. I see. Know? But the bots are good for uh, running around the planet and harassing the enemy, uh, destroying his metal, uh, metal, um, the metal, whatever you call extractors, mm -hmm. and, uh, and then like going around his base. And if you see something unprotected, you attack. And then you, guerrilla tactics, you know, the bots yeah. and the vehicles are for making, you know, doing proper war and making real damage. And okay. the aircraft are for uh, lots of stuff. You have bombers, uh, which you, with which you can use snipe the commander. If the commander dies. You lose the game, but now that hmm. there's three of us, we have three commanders, so we have to lose all three commanders to lose. Okay. When a commander dies, there's a nuclear explosion. So if you have a lot of units around him, your your units go with that explosion. Hmm. Um. Well, what else should I tell you? You just have to figure out with the units. Um. You have to figure out what units beat what, what units, so that when you have a, an army, uh. If you just attack and you don't know what you're attacking, there's a good chance you will lose the army. But right mm, now, yeah. we have so many units, even I don't know what beats what. 
<laughs> so you're just gonna have to basically use some units and then do trial and error. So if you see them dying very quickly, then pull back. If okay. you see them making some damage, then you record in your brain uh, what units you had, what the opponent had, and then you think, you know... Yeah, you're gonna have to learn <laughs> while, you, while you play. So, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but okay. the thing is that uh, you'll have to be, because we're gonna make one base, Mm -hmm. And this this is just one planet, but it's huge. So you're gonna have to be moving at like three fronts at the same time, like north, okay. southwest, yeah. and southeast. Uh, uh, you don't have a question. You can have uh, multiple cameras, right? Yeah. Um, you you set a camera with shift one. Okay. And shift then you one. jump to that point with control one. Okay. And then shift two, you set another camera with control two. You jump to that. Okay. Uh, but that's that. You should you should put a camera right over our base. So a shift one should be right over our base, mm -hmm. and then try to zoom out a little bit so that because if you zoom in too much, then you later can't see on people coming, coming. You can't see shit. Yeah. Uh, but you don't want to zoom out too much so that you can't see the units. You basically want to zoom out so that you can see the icons because the icons are more useful than the actual units. Ah, uh, I see. It's much easier to select the icons than to select units. Uh, it basically, it's, it's unplayable. The, the the units are only for, you know, if you're if you're destroying the opponent and you have nothing to worry about, you can just zoom in and watch them fight. But that happens okay. very rarely. Hmm. Um, and then you can also make command groups, but I don't know the. I think it's Alt One or something. And Alt then if you, okay. you select a bunch of units and then you hit Alt One, I think it's Alt One. Mm -hmm. And then whenever you hit just one. It, it selects back that group of units, so you can hit Alt-1, Alt-2, Alt-3, and make three little command groups, one to the north, one to the south, and whatever. And then with right. one, two, three, you can cycle between them and move them around, and uh, you're looking for you're looking for undefended bases. You're looking especially for the metal extractors. It's the little... Uh, hold on, let me see what these guys are saying. So we need two guys now, right? See, these guys are not leaving Recall. You know why they're not leaving? Because they know we're gonna have a good time. Yeah. <laughs> so they don't mind waiting five. They don't mind waiting five ten minutes. Whereas before, um, uh, Gojira, when we we're trying to fill up a lobby, the randoms they come in, and if if the lobby doesn't fill up in two minutes, they leave. Mm, but yeah. in, if if they wait, you know, all these, if they just waited for five minutes, we would have filled it up, and we end up like waiting for fifteen minutes because they just leave, mm. and the moment they leave, other people come. Hmm. But you see, these guys, they're, they're, they they know that something special is happening here. You don't get 15 player games every day. And, yeah. uh, you know, and they know that we're cool and all that. So, they don't mind waiting a few minutes. Hmm. Yeah, I'm so excited. Two more players. So right now we have, uh, we have 13. So we have one less than the last game. Um. I could add this one guy, if we don't want to wait. I could add this one guy to one of the other teams. I don't mind playing a 3v3v3v4 three v three v or whatever. Or I could give him two AIs, or I could get him to play alone, but double his economy. Mm. Or 1.5 his economy, I don't know exactly what. Uh, make some spec slots, okay. Well, that blue torch guy left. Uh, ready up, guys. When oh, I added uh, the, uh, the spec slots, it unreadied everybody. Uh, yeah, I could always... Uh, I say I will give it two more minutes. <laughs>
There we go. I think it's gonna give us the option to uh, spawn in two different uh, spawn points now because it's only five teams and I think it goes up to I don't know how many teams it goes up to but I think it's gonna give us only one well maybe two but I think we should still uh, because we have Kojiro which is still I think except if me and Kojiro go to one spot and he does my army and you recall go if we have two you go to another one I don't know if you prefer that I guess we'll have to decide Well, the other thing, hand, I think that it's going to be such a slaughter that even if we don't get a lot of uh, uh, territory, if we if we just dig in and let them kill themselves, hmm. we'll have yeah. a good chance. It might be better if we did mega base. Yeah, I think I think it might be better because uh, who knows what all these guys will be doing, and then if we just all you have to do is just get a bit lucky. Of course, now I cannot remove any team because this guy he has to move basically. Yeah, yeah, I guess. Oh, there we go. Right. Ready up. <laughs> okay, now we have. Okay, uh, we have one and two. We have two points. Let me see. Uh, two, two has most most metal. Yeah. Um. Oh. I okay. say we just make a mega base on two, man. All right. Okay, uh, so Recall is in charge of grabbing metal and defending it. Kojiro is in charge of uh, attacking with the units and uh, figuring out the map, and I'm in charge of the base. Okay, right. and we uh, put all our commanders. You have to go to two. I'm gonna land Okay, here. go to point two. And then uh, here. here, here is best. Just click there, and then click Start Annihilation. Okay. And put your Shift 1, your camera anchor, so you uh, can... Um, one. And then and then move around and test it by clicking Control One and see if uh, it takes it be Alt there. One. Uh, yeah, wait. Wait. Sorry, nothing. Shift One. Shift One. Shift One. Uh, yeah. sh shift One to lock it and then Alt One to go back to it. Yeah, and Alt One to go back. Right, right, right. He's right. Hey, for a 1300 planet, it's still loading fast. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, so, uh... Okay, you uh, make energy okay. with your single... Uh, don't do anything for the time being, uh, Kojiro. Yeah, okay. Just wait until we have units for you. Uh, don't take the units with a plus over them, those are the fabbers. You take all the other units except the commanders and the units with a plus. And, yeah. uh, Rico's gonna take, so he's gonna make his own bots and uh, he's gonna go out for. Okay. Uh, I'm putting down some energy. Okay. Alright, you can uh, take over my commander once he's done with that energy. Okay, okay. Yeah. And uh, start. Yeah. Great. Uh, I was trying to check out the cameras, but was it. Was it shift one? Because I don't think it's it's working. It's shift one, yeah. Okay. It's not working. Uh, and then shift one to shed it, to, to set it, and then... Uh, 
No. Swift want to share to set it and then Alt want to, to, to jump to it. You still haven't been able to make it work? Uh shift one. Alt one. Oh, uh I I think that worked. Okay. Let's see. It worked or no? Yeah, I got it working. Okay. Okay. Now I have some. Can you see these three tanks here? Uh, yeah, I see it. Okay, those are tanks, so you can take them and move around the map. Don't go far from the base. Uh, you want to protect the base first of all. Go in all, all directions of the base, and I'll keep making. You know what, uh, man? I'm gonna go T2 vehicles right now. Why not? Ah, maybe not. Fuck it. You might have the. Uh, could have the economy soon. The energy's good for it. Uh, I don't know yeah, about metal though. You know what I'm afraid? I'm afraid that Kojiro is not going to know which ones are the T2, so he's not going <laughs> to use them well. Oh boy. Uh, we need scouts if you can. Yeah, uh, yeah. You, you can take charge of that if you want. If you want to make scouts, make a little factory and make your own scouts. Alright, I'm going to build an air um, factory. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. build a couple as well. Okay, let's see. Uh, <laughs> Do you see? And here you can see another little group you can take and move in the other direction. Can you see it? Oh, yeah, got it. And here uh, you can see more. So all these units that you see coming out, these are yours. That's what you play with. You wanna... you... you okay, I have to put down a, um, a radar. Okay, I'm, I'm getting the hang of this slowly. <laughs> great, great, great. Uh, we got guys up here. If you could send those tanks to where I pinged it. To uh, see where ping. the ping is, you have to click on where it says on the top of the screen where it says ping. Ping again yep, if got you... it. Right. Got it. Make sure that there's never any units uh, uh, yeah, they're in the base, in, in our base waiting, because then they're they right be there. wasted. You have to c keep coming back to the base and grabbing more units throughout the entire game. Okay. Uh, we're getting assaulted. Over here. Yeah. Send all the, all the units you can. Those are just boats, so you can see that they're boats. We're not making any boats right now for you. We're just making a uh, vehicle army for you. Yep. It, uh, that means it moves slowly, so you have to plan your. You, you don't take them too far from the base and make yeah. sure that uh, they can get back to the base if they need to. Of course, it's a huge planet, so it's easier to send them. Oh, uh, there's a bunch of orange down here. With, with G, you uh, you you ping with G. Uh, First okay. You, you hit G and then you click on the map and then we can. Uh, we I know see. We Got it. Okay, we see it there. Yeah, we see it. You have to find where the base is so that you can. Uh, which one is the closest base to us? So you have to like go around us in circles yeah. until you find the closest base and then try to attack it from from a direction where it doesn't have lasers and defenses and shit. And you, some of your of your tanks are anti-air. The ones with the anti-air, they have the slash on them. Okay. So the the anti-air is there just to protect you if the enemy has planes. So don't put them in the front, you know. Okay. What am I supposed to be doing now? I'm supposed to be making. Uh, uh need anti-air units. Uh, more anti-air, or you mean more planes? Or planes or anti-air. Either one's fine. Okay, okay I'm gonna do both, a little bit of both then. I'm gonna make one factory to just make anti-air then. Enemy detected. Are, you Wait, getting, are you getting a lot of metal for us? How are you yeah, doing with metal? Yeah, um, we're doing alright. We have a surplus right now. So, what Gojira has to do, oh, he has to there's... find... Oh, I can see over there, yeah, there, there, yeah, I can see it. Um... I'm sending some units in that direction for you. You'll see okay. them going. Uh, we just have to decide now... I'm gonna switch my fabric... Uh factory to bots for now so you have more offensive options those guys move a bit faster so you could use them as scouts yeah 
You sure you have enough fabbers? Yeah, I got plenty. I'm going T2 with vehicles, man. Yeah, the economy is just going up and down and up and down. It's like a nut. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, there you're getting yeah. destroyed because you don't have anti-air uh, in your composition. Uh, we have some planes. I'm going to send them towards there. Although, there's nothing left there, but I'm sending them. Uh, you can move the planes too, Yakujiro. You know what the, pl the planes look like, right? Uh, triangles. Yeah, the triangles. Um, you just have to learn what the anti-air is on the ground so that you don't take our air force over the uh, anti-air and just lose it. But I mean, you're gonna lose, you're gonna lose some. Yeah, gonna figure it um, out. they got a really big base over there. Let me see. It. Yeah, uh, is that the closest one to us, or can you find the closest one? Uh, I think it's pretty close. I think it's pretty close over there. Um, yeah, uh, you, you have to decide which way to attack and then you have to take all our forces pretty much and uh, attack there quickly and then come back. <laughs> uh, energy is okay. tanking. <laughs> yeah, I can see, I can see. The energy is tanking uh, because I'm, uh, I'm finishing the... Um, T2. Oh, damn, T2. I didn't even know you were making that. <laughs> yeah. This is all bad. I'm making it. Uh, almost done. I got some bots right here. Oh, I'll just send... Just send what I have. I'll make some T2 fabbers uh, right away, and uh, just to upgrade some metal. Okay. Oops. Big Air Force over there. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah. Try to get the planes going over there. Although they have uh, the other guys have a lot more planes. Um, let me see. Okay. Okay, the first uh, T2 Faber is going to be out soon. Oh my god, they have a big Air Force over there. I'm going to have to start making anti-air in our base. Yeah, yeah that's a huge force. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, you just have to yeah, move the units back. Move the units back. Yeah. Uh, well, okay, I'm going to put. I'm going to start putting more anti-air in the composition then. Yeah, that's gonna that should take care of it. Okay, finally we have a T2 Faber. He's gonna upgrade all the metal in the base. Um, uh, we got a uh, yellow to north. Yeah, I can see that. Uh, although you're mainly clashing with the with the orange knight right yeah. now. Yeah, right? you have not clashed yeah. with yellow so far. So maybe. If uh, leave the the yellow alone. Hopefully he doesn't um, he doesn't put his attention on us. Okay. Oops. Uh, over here we have I don't know what these units are. Oh. Uh. They're bots, but I, oh, they're the boom bots. I don't know, not the boom bots, spiders. I don't, I don't know what they do. Okay, um, finally, T2 energy is up, so our energy is doing good. T2, some T2 metal, but our metal is shit, so I'm gonna stop building stuff until the metal isn't uh, green. Oh, those. And, those air units can't attack ground. You need bombers. Oh, uh, yeah. You okay. need bombers, and uh, we're not making any bombers, send, so you're gonna, you're gonna need send the in, tanks. Send in tanks. Okay, Does the energy problem is solved. Oh, jeez. Oh, they're coming. Yeah. <laughs> they're coming, and uh, they're gonna try to snipe a commander, and they they have 2-2 two -two air among them, but... Oh, 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 and there's a huge force coming. Why didn't we see it earlier, man? Ah, we didn't see it. I'm, se I'm sending everything there. We didn't see it earlier. Uh, they got T2 in the mix. Uh, yeah, they they're do. not gonna win they this. Do. Well, uh, if it's not too much, we might win it. If if we bring everything from uh, yeah. all around, we might. Yeah, I think we're gonna win this. Commanders might be able to help too. If, if yeah, you're right. Get no. an Uber shot on them. Yeah, yeah. 
I'm bringing a commander. If we just saw that earlier, look at all these units that we have surrounding them. We could have taken them out, but that's one of our big problems that I haven't been able to. You have to do the, you know, the intelligence. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, I'm attacking them. Uh, yeah, it looks like they're gonna get the commander, and there's gonna be a nuclear explosion there. Okay. Okay. Uh, now take that army and go go south with everything. Go to that right. enemy base with everything we, we, we got right we now. We still got the T2. Oh, you need to build side. something. Yeah. They're coming from this side. Don't don't go away. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, we still have the TT factory. I'm gonna start building shellers then. Just shellers. Shit, they're gonna get him. We still got one commander left, so. Okay, well, take everything down. Now let's see how that works. Uh, okay, in the meantime, let me see. Okay, you started another TT factory, right? Yeah, but metal's not going to be able to keep up. Uh, look, leave that building to me and try to get more metal up. All right. I'm going to take one of the TT fabbers and start upgrading. Oh, jeez. What? There is... Whoa, whoa, what was it? Oh, yeah, oh, these... Oh, Kaiju. Are, these are amphibious things. I don't know why they're building them. Uh, it's There's plenty of water. But are they good on land? They, they're not supposed to be good on land if they're amphibious. Look, we're taking them down, so... Yeah. Uh, okay. You know what, uh, Kojiro? Uh, forget about the push. Just um, stand They're back. Still coming. Stand back. Yeah. yeah uh, put them all over here, so that at least we can defend if they attack. You don't have enough to attack, but maybe you can hold yeah. them off here, there, and I'll try to build some. You know what I'm gonna try to build? If we could get yeah. the metal up, I would try to go into space and build a, a space defense thingy. Should be getting there. We'll have T2 metal soon. A bunch more. Uh, we got a ca idle commander. Uh, you can see we have some T2 units here. Uh, T2 uh, uh, Gojiro. You can see the bigger ones. The the, the bigger uh, ones are tanks. Yeah. Uh, T2 tanks, and these are these are quite good. One of uh. them. So, yeah. So now, and we have more coming out. So start moving them south, but not too far south. Yeah. Okay. You just want to make sure uh, that when they attack, as we they need don't a, have. We need to defend this side. You need to dis defend these two big factories because that's how we make our good units right now. Right. Um, okay. Okay. I gotta figure out where all these units are. Yeah. Um, you can tell if something is anti-air if it has a slanted line. If it has a flat mm -hmm. line, that means it's an air attacker. Yeah. I, that means it's ground. It's, it's a ground. It's ground. It's ground. Yeah. And you can see. Yeah. And you can zoom in to see what the units look like. Uh, that helps. And then zoom out. Okay, energy's good. Metal's still shit. No more T2 factories for until the metal goes to plus. And, uh, okay. Yeah, now you have T2 uh, in the mix and... Okay, the energy's good now. Start pushing south, but wait until your units are in a big bunch. Uh, yeah, they're just holding out over there. Yeah, make a huge bunch, and then uh, it's you have you can wait. You have a lot of anti-air now, so they can't ton of anti-air. Like, look, all the stuff here is anti-air. So uh, if they come to the air force again, it's just gonna get cut down. Right. Okay. Um, you just need to leave, let some time for the two T two factories to pump out a bunch of units. And you need to keep grabbing them from here. That's yeah. what, but, but I'm actually gonna I'm, gonna I'm actually gonna set the factories to send them right here, so they're gonna automatically be sent there. So you don't have to. Uh, sim speed went down to 64. It's funny though because we have nothing. Like we have very very few units. I guess the other guys are. 
I don't even know what to do now because the metal is the problem. We're um, energy is not a problem, but there's no point in building more shit until the. Uh, uh, we got yellow moving in here. Oh yeah. Uh, he's uh, he's not moving too much though. Maybe he won't. Um, There's something. Yeah, oh. that's the uh, nano swarm. I don't know what it does. It's uh, it's new. It's in Titans. Okay, uh. Destroyed it. Yeah, now you ha you have a bunch of anti-air left, so... Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get much further in the game, unless we get really lucky. Yep, Yellow's moving in here. Commander's gonna get a hit. Can we expand here at least? No, we can't. Yeah, and they're coming with T2 bots from here. Yeah, yellow's gonna get get us. Uh, yeah. Orange gonna get us. Yeah. We're losing the T2. Yeah, it's game over. From two directions. We just needed to be... Uh, look, that first attack, if we knew it was coming, we would have repulsed it. And then that would have been a good time for a counterattack. So we I see. see. And it came through. I don't know why it came through, because we had units all around, but it still came through. We saw it at the last moment. Well, we can spend the rest of the game uh, spectating, I guess. Yep. Oh, wow. That's a... Uh... And if you want to spectate... Oh my god, look at that Air Force. Yeah, look at that Air Force! Oh. It's like everywhere. Huh. Um, hit uh, spectate. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm watching. I mean, Orange is like one half of a planet. Yeah, That's pretty spread out. Man. Damn. I got a good setup. So, yeah. Purple is like us if nobody had been attacking us. Hmm. And oh, yeah, yellow's gonna lose. He made a lot of units in the in the water that are just sitting there. And Kojiro, this is a game with one planet, man. You can play with six, seven planets. We played. Can you imagine? Yeah, that's. Uh... You didn't even see. You didn't even see naval. You didn't see uh, orbital. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. I like this guy. He has a minefield here. We never. Oh, I'll ping it. Uh, I can't ping it. He has a minefield that we never, it's the little X's. The, mm -hmm. uh, we never use that for some reason. We don't know what it does exactly. There's so many units, we don't even know what they do. And yellow has all these little nano storms going around. I don't know what they're used for. They're kind of like harassers. They're like boom bots, except they don't suicide. Mm. And we haven't seen any nu nukes yet. Uh, is there a key to force units to be in some, uh, like, preset formation or something? I don't think so. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna have to just look at controls and figure things out. Um, later on, once you start, uh, if you can before Saturday, play some games on your own. Mm -hmm. um, 1v1s or whatever. Uh, you should install two mods. Uh, I'll I'll post them in the forum about them. One mod uh, makes all your factories go on infinite build immediately, mm -hmm. so that uh, whatever unit you you order, it's gonna keep making it infinitely. So you don't have to keep going back to the for uh, to the factory and ordering more units. And then the other mod, if you have some factories that are idle, that mod immediately makes them build something. 
Mm-hmm. Because, okay. you know, you want to keep everything building in the game. You, sometimes you want to shut factories down on your own, but this is it's quite advanced. For the early game, you want everything to be, you know... Okay, we got a commander down. He has that big earth just going around and sniping commanders. Well, we're playing, um, what is it, Three, 12 people on the biggest planet, and it's lagging, but uh, but it's not too bad, it's playable. And it's definitely not the best server we could get, so... So yeah, the the guys that are winning is always Prime, mm. uh, who is the guy who, you know, he's always Prime, and the other guy looking for PA students are the the, the guys that I told you earlier that uh, the the the, uh, the best that are playing right now every day, pretty much. Yeah, I kind of figured that out. <laughs> so yeah. Hmm. They have their build orders. And I like the fact that even though they don't play big games this big all the time, they still figured out how to expand quickly. Mm. Meanwhile, you can see that the purple guy, he's turtling because where's she going to go? Right, yeah. And yellow's he's, uh, he's surrounded. His navy's, navy's going to go down soon. That air force is ridiculous, but it's all... Anti-air, and there's one bomber in it. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, there's like two bombers in it. Really? <laughs> <laughs> so what does it do? Does it? It can't do. It. Oh, he, uh, you mean purples? Yeah, purples, yeah, purples. Is, is ridiculous. You can see that it's a turtle. Uh, he's not. He's not planning to attack anybody. He just wants to defend himself. Mm. When the, when the other air force comes for him. I guess. I guess orange is just saving him for last. <laughs> It's pretty much over. <laughs> Why has the music stopped? Have you, has the music stopped for you guys too? Is it because we're spectating? Yeah, I guess. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're dead. And it's like, you don't get music if you're not. <laughs> that's your, uh, that's your punishment for losing. Purple's on the move, I think. Oh. He's trying to take down. He, oh, okay. And he's, and he's moving because back. Yellow's got his army caught in between. He can't really do anything with that. <laughs> I mean, he'll take out a lot of air units, but... Hmm. He should go now, he should go, he's going, he's going for it. Uh, there he goes, there's the yep, there's yep. A battle. <laughs> look at that, look at that! <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> the commander's right there, too. Yeah, they're gonna snipe him. They're gonna snipe him right now. Look. I guess they just want the nuclear explosion to take him out. Oh! Well, that's look, but no. he's leaving! He's, he's saving the units, <laughs> he he's saving them. Doesn't, yeah. Nice. So that's called micro. That's what you should have been doing, Gojiro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gojiro has like he has like ten minutes in the game, and he's playing with these guys uh, like two thousand hours. <laughs> uh. We've been studying like videos for like two years. That's a. Uh that is an air war. <laughs> I 
If I was purple, I would just surrender. <laughs> <laughs> well, Getting that? attacked by he, two armies. <laughs> he's sitting there, the commander has an anti-nuke next to him, you see it? But nobody's building nukes for him. <laughs> hmm. No intel on his part. There are so many options. You can build nukes, you can build the titans and attack somebody. You can build uh, the air, big air forces like now and snipe people. You can mm. build um, uh, orbital units and just build like uh, orbital bombers right over his base. And then, so right now these guys chose this, so you're seeing one, but there's so many options. Mm. And the thing is, you have to know which option your opponent goes to, because all the options have a counter. If you know ahead of time what he has, if you knew he has an air force, then you can make anti-air on the ground, you can make anti-air vehicles, you can make your own air force. If he's going for uh, space, then you have a completely different thing, you have to build umbrellas and shit like mm -hmm. that. So you need good intel, and that's the thing that I've never been able to, um, to do well. Because it takes time to do the intel, you know, you have to fly the little airplane around to lick what the other guys are doing, you have to... Then, so I mm. can't do this while I'm building the freaking base. Right. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to play this more so I can figure out what people are doing. The best thing would be to go by yourself in the multiplayer and put one AI against you, put an easy mm -hmm. AI, beat it. Then put the next step up AI, beat that too. And mm. then, uh, while you do this, you're learning more and more about, uh, you know, the different uh, vehicles and and uh, different uh, units that exist. But it's going to take a long time until you can play with these guys, um, like, on equal terms. Mm. So that you can spawn on your own and build your own base, and it's going to take a long time. But uh, for this Saturday, I'm hoping that uh, if it's just you, me, and I aligned, and we got two guys against us, then it will be a 3v2. And I'll have the extra commander, which is a lot of build power in the beginning, hmm. and then uh, and then we might have a good, decent showing that way. And we use this planet; it's huge. So right now we we're playing with uh, what is it, uh, twelve people? But if it's six people, it will take quite a bit of time until we start. Uh, what is this guy doing now, man? He's why is he not getting the other commander? Uh, is mm. he sitting with a lot of anti-air? He has, yeah, he has T3 anti-air around him. T2 anti-air around him, which is, um... And he's building the, uh, the Ares Titan. He's building the, uh, the Flying Titan. It has a T oh. over it. If you see in the middle of the, um, the purple base. Oh, I see it now. The T, oh. yeah, that, that thing flies in the air and, uh... Yellow huh. just surrendered. <laughs> Who surrendered? Yellow. Well, oh yeah, yellow. Yeah. Thing is, I don't know why the 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 yellow the orange has so much more production. He could do two three things at the same time. He could do the nukes at the same time as the he you know he nobody's going orbital really. They have some orbital fibers, but that's it. It's like they're just whittling him down. Uh, he's just taking down the factories. Okay. Yeah, but now the, the, the Iris is up and is fighting oh, air force. He's got a Zeus. <laughs> the, the Zeus, right. The, the Zeus fights air as well, right? Yeah. Okay, the commander should be going down soon. Whoa, well, took, he took him out. He took down the air force. <laughs> <laughs> the air force is gone. Of course, there's more coming. I still can't speak to everybody. You said shift and enter. Yeah. yeah I'm hitting it and I'm hitting it and that's, I don't know, it's annoying. I don't know what all these nanostroms do now. Yeah, it's not working for me either. Well, the uh, the the iris is gone. Man. So. 
Really? We've been only playing for 25 minutes? Uh, sim speed's down by 64, so... That's okay. not really been 25 minutes. Maybe like 40 or something, right? So like that, 35. Yeah, look at the pathetic purple base now. I like that you can see the uh, the uh, unit uh, wreckage because before Titans they they didn't have it. Hmm. They took it out because the sim uh, slowed down a lot, and then they put it back again. Okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. Man, I can't even say GG. Uh, okay, <laughs> there we go. Now I can say GG. Huh. Well, we're gonna try. I'm gonna try to see if I can um, do the multi planet now. We'll see if the guys come. All right. So I guess, Rickle, you can restart the server. Yeah. Check the browser and see if everybody quit. The browser. Check that first, okay. Yeah, it looks like they're still in. I would have liked to still get the music while I'm spectating. Oh, in progress. I could just... I didn't even see that game state. Where does it say that? On the left sidebar. It says game state and status. Put it into in progress and any. Or just put everything to any so you can see everything. Hmm. Any. Okay, great. That's great. And then refresh. You could go in and spectate too. Ah, I didn't know that. I don't see our server. Oh shit. Oh, I saw it. Did you put status oh, wait, on no, any? Now I see it. Now I see it. Now I see it. Uh, and... I, I'm gonna kick everybody off for resetting it. Yeah, do that. Yeah, do that. Alright. Uh, get ready to check the lobby. Okay. Should be up. I'm yeah, when, I'm in the settings right now, so give me one second. Uh, it's not you, you. You can come later. The important thing is that I go in so that yeah, I, I take the server and nobody else takes it. I'm going out. Mm -hmm. I just go went in. Well, now with three commanders. We should be able to go to the other planet faster. The main thing that's keeping us back is the freaking... Um, oh, bot one's the host. <laughs> oh. Uh, you got it first. He even added his own uh, overcooked pizza, his own system. 
<laughs> Alright, it looks like you're host now. Uh, yeah, it looks like, but what about this? Okay, I'm gonna kick the guy. Great. Now we're 56 minutes. That's four dollars, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can see right now how, my, how much we played? Yeah. How many minutes again? Uh, hour 56. That's not bad. Well, uh, it's a lot of fun and uh, it's, it's worth it, it's worth it. And we've tested, okay, I'm gonna put like two spectator seats just in case. How did we get gray? I had chosen white for us, and uh, these guys got the white. I guess I'll go for red or something. Yeah, let's go for... No, red, because we're gonna go... I guess this time we're gonna have to go to the metal planet if we don't want to lose. <laughs> So, uh, let's go for blue. Yeah, I don't know if the other guys are gonna come back. They always prime and... Well, they're not in the channel now anymore in the, uh... Three v three, they're gonna destroy us.
I don't know why he says not many people are on at this time because what time is it in the US right now? All the servers were in the US, US West or something. Well, it's yeah. about 8.30 here. Eight thirty, so that's prime time, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Three V V three V three considered to be big in my opinion. That is not big. No, he left. Oh no, he's on the other two. Someone wants to get kicked. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because we're the ones who are paying here and we're not impatient and these guys are getting it for f How did they have the same color as us? I remember F M F Doom from yesterday but I don't remember did he actually play uh, with us, or did he leave? I don't the think lobby? he did. But since we got the custom server up, he seems like he's down now. MF Doom doesn't want to share. Yeah, it looks like... Oh, okay, there we go. Yeah. Well, I think, you know what? If we can play these games on a weekday, on the weekends, we can play whatever the fuck we want, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It should be at least twice as many people, and then we should be able to fill... We got to figure out when they actually you can go on P on uh, Steam Spy or Steam Stats or something like that, and you can see exactly what time of the day I think is best for PA, and then you can play. Then you can open up a lobby for like 20 people, 25 people, and I think you know. Sorry, he wants to get kicked again. <laughs> <laughs> well, in the old days, I would have kicked him because I would have had a lot of people try to get into my lobby, you know, but now... Hmm. 
No, he's counting down. <laughs> 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 I changed our color. They're probably gonna change it again. Yeah. Well, three v three v three is not three v three. It's not bad. Uh. Uh, one more. You got another guy? Nice. I think that, um... If you're willing to wait, and if you're not paying like we're paying now, then you're bound to fill the server eventually because every single new player that comes in the lobby is going to see this lobby and it looks so cool and he's going to want to join. You see what I'm saying? So as long as uh, you have uh, you know, a few people, six people or something, who are willing to wait 5 or 10 minutes or even 15 minutes, then you're going to fill that lobby, I think. <laughs> yeah, we'll see her. Well, it's starting to fill up. We can never get a server. <laughs> <laughs> you know, instead of the humble indie bundle, I would make the arrogant uh, <laughs> defending bundle or something. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off, and it would be like uh, like with a PS3, you know, Sony said you should get two jobs to, to, to afford it. Mm. Uh, you could, I guess you could turn back Sharon for Team 3 since MF Doom most. Oh. Well, see, I can change my color. This guy is changing. Uh, oh, he's changing yeah. his color. But he's not. He's not supposed to be allowed to do it. I don't know how he does it. He probably has some sort of change it real fast and then hit start. <laughs> yeah, that's what. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. It, it doesn't. It, when I change the color, it doesn't unready people, does it? Yeah, I don't think so. Nowadays, there we go. Change it real quick. <laughs> no, but I kicked. I kicked to the guy, the Amadeus. So we're gonna have to wait. Oh shit! Oh. Yeah, I kicked him because he wasn't reading up. There we go. Oh. Now he's back. <laughs>
<laughs> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm ready. Uh. <laughs> now somebody else left, Lord Devil. Uh. Man, they're more impatient than wit. Uh. <laughs> Never <Netherlander>. leaving. <laughs> uh. Ready up, guys. Uh, these guys are gonna leave, they're like... We're gonna have to kick these guys too now. <laughs> <laughs> In the end, or it's just gonna be us with AI, and we spend our playing the lobby minigame. I don't care, I mean, I really don't care. We already had two good games, great games, so... <laughs> they left. Yeah. Oh, you kicked them? No, I kicked them. See, right now, all these people in the last 5-10 minutes, we could have done a 20-player game if they all stayed and read it up. You just get this these morons that, uh, and I mean, they're so stupid that even if they were actually in the game, what happens is you lose about 20% of them, they disconnect within 5 minutes because I don't know why. They spend all this time, they get in the game and then they disconnect. And then a few of them, they don't know that they don't have the computer to run this game and it crashes others. You know. So really, if you want if you want to play good games, you really have to set them up with a clan. I, if, if, if you're lucky every now and then, you can play, uh, and if you're patient, you can play a big, nice game in the lobby, but... But I think on the weekend, it will be much easier. Oh, well. <laughs> uh. <laughs> they wanted to play a 3v3 that could just make their own server. <laughs>
No, he's back. Hey, well, They're asking for AI. They can go fuck themselves. I'm adding another team. <laughs> <laughs> Ready up, guys. Okay, I was gonna say to Amadez that I will kick if you don't ready up, but here I up. Mm. Re uh, recall, ready up. <laughs> BRB, two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> That's <was> great. <laughs> <laughs> But is that is that real or is that a joke? I mean, <laughs> Who knows? The team. There we go. Yeah. As long as they, yeah. Well, now we have a spectator. I don't think we had a spectator before. I opened the <coughs> slots, but nobody went. He's He's been there a while. Oh, they have more people coming. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> this guy MF Doom messaged me to kick the other two people. And mm -hmm. I guess I'm gonna message him back, move down one team. So now it's gonna be a 15 player game, I changed the name. Let's see if it's actually gonna happen. Ready up, guys. <laughs> Is that okay? Never mind. <laughs> They're playing another game now. They're doing what?
Wit said, okay, never mind. Get rid of slots. They're playing another game now. Okay. Should just play it like this. <laughs> MF Doom doesn't want to be a team player. <laughs> no, he has people. He's waiting oh, for people. Oh, he said he's waiting. Okay, cool. Well, the thing is, if we keep doing this, eventually people will learn. Like, like these people, wait. you know. <laughs> wait no, and no, get these your people, friends. These people that, uh, uh, they, they will see our server, they know what's up, they see the, the name, it's a 12-player game, and then if they don't want to come, they won't come. If they feel like uh, waiting, they will wait. Oh, yeah. Mm. I mean, they've, they've been, they've been uh, you know, harassing me now for 10 minutes or 15 minutes to start, and I have, I'm not starting. So, they're going to get bored eventually. Hmm. Oh, look, it, it filled up. I could even uh, open up a new team. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, uh, it's okay. We can do. We can play with, with twelve. They can't ready up while while their system is loading. So. Got the girl. So MF Doom with his friends. <laughs> Where is he? Mm. <laughs> Man. It's like dating. <laughs> <laughs> like in. He's viewing MF Doom, I can see him now, he's on my friend list. He's viewing games browser. So Mm. Yeah. He came in, told me to kick some guys, open up a slot for him. It's all this, all this drama, and then in the end, nothing happened. Just <laughs> 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 uh, the waste of time. Uh. Yeah, he's been jumping on, but I don't even remember playing a game with him. Now MF Doom's hosting. <laughs> He's doing a one-on-one. -on -one. Huh. I guess one of his friends dropped out. Two v two on shared or crack. Three v three on shared. So he's just making his own lobby, I guess. Yeah, three v three on shared. Are they adding slot? Well, you can say whatever you want for these guys, but uh, they're bitching, but they still haven't left. So. Yeah, uh, they really want to play uh. this 12-player game. <laughs> <laughs> you got got <laughs> 
So then, the replay is saved on the private server, Rico? Um, yeah, like all everything is saved on PA stats. Okay, nice. Yeah, I guess because the custom server is um. Oh, oh MF Doom's back. back. <laughs> <laughs> he just needs to accept he wants to play here. <laughs> there we go. Let me ask them if I should open up one more thing. Ev <laughs> 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 uh. <laughs> Doom's gone down. We lost him. Ev <laughs> uh. Doom left. <laughs> I told him about his ass, he didn't like that. <laughs> there he goes, there he goes, oh, he's he back. Is. <laughs> Anything you want, that the last two teams are just gonna get obliterated, and team number two is gonna win. And hopefully we'll we'll be second, I guess. Okay, there we go. Hmm. How did he ready up if his computer hasn't finished uh, loading? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. There we go. <laughs> we did it. Are, some people are just gonna disconnect within like. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, we're going to Bifrost. This is the planet. Okay. And we have uh, two spawn points. Oh here. yeah. Maybe, huh? Okay. Uh, let's all go to uh, planet to spawn point two. Are we gonna uh, uh, rush right. orbital? Right here, yeah, we're gonna rush. Everybody put your commander right there. I don't know why we have freaking purple. I didn't choose that. And, uh, are you- do, do you put your commander there, Kojiro? Uh, yeah. Okay. And, uh, we're gonna go on the metal planet this time. Let me find a nice spot. Okay, I found a nice spot. Okay, so the plan is, uh, I take all the commanders, I make uh, an orbital factory, and we go to the other planet, and then we leave this planet behind. Oh. The other guys oh, can okay. fight over it, you see? So, because we're using all the commanders to build the orbit orbital factory, we're going to be the first on the new planet. So, if we rush, we might be able to get the entire planet to ourselves, you see? Uh, uh, but I'm... the third planet uh, is like a Death Star, that's the one we're going to. And if you build on one of the poles a uh, six catalyst or five catalyst, uh, you can blow up I the see. other planets. Yeah, the Uber weapon or something? It's called the Annihilator. <laughs> Alright. And this is where we're gonna land on the other planet. So if you wanna put a camera anchor there. Yeah. And then we'll see, it will be me and you on the other planet, and maybe we can leave uh, Recall back here, see if he can get a hold on the... Can you move your uh, ground units through that little uh, land? Yeah. But there's, there's no point to grab that, because there's no metal on this little land, and then they're gonna destroy you from, from all around with their ships, you see? So I think you should just, if you do stay, you should just uh, go uh, naval immediately. But I, I'm not sure if it's a good idea for you to say. You decide. Well. Okay, now we're waiting for um, one little uh, fabric to come out. Okay, and now I can build the orbital. Fucking. Ah, uh, it's not letting me build it. Okay. 
I'm gonna build it over there. And I'm gonna shut down this factory. Actually, you know what? Uh, maybe we can make another faber. Ah, uh, no, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Alright, uh, make okay. like the portal. Make the portal. Uh, actually, I, I want to rush. I, I'm going to use two of the commanders to rush, to rush the the, uh, the thing, and then use the other guys. Get some metal up and get some energy up. Okay, it's gone. Um. Uh, I guess you can you can keep making some uh, orbital stuff, maybe a couple of Avengers. And now, if you zoom out, uh, Kojiro, you can see our orbital faber is going to the other planet. Yeah, I can see the path. Yeah. Um, it's gonna take a while because I made the system. I should have made the planets uh, be moons around each other. That would be faster. Whereas now, actually, this uh, this oh, it's gonna be quite fast. This one. That's how they got there fast last time. So mm -hmm. this planet is not that bad. Okay, we, we should be up soon, Eric. Also, uh, make the portal. Yeah, it's almost done. Great, it's that's up. awesome. And make make sure we have we have the energy. That's right. And uh, so make a few uh, orbital units then, because yeah. we can send them quickly. I'm making Avengers. Awesome. Yeah, we have enough orbital fiber, so now you can switch to Avengers. We don't need more. Are you sending the Avengers straight to the other planet? I'm sending everything that comes out of the orbital factory immediately to where... Okay. You don't have to worry about that. I'll try and keep a foothold here. Okay. So we can see what's going on. Okay. Okay, I'm on the other planet. I'm putting down the portal. You can see it, Gojiro. Are you ready for and the... Then, yeah. Is the portal and then, Yep, the portal yeah, is coming portal. up. I connected them. I connected okay. them. And, uh, okay. okay. I'm going to send all three commanders your way. Okay. Uh, okay. I'll let you know when there's something for you to um to move, Kojiro. Yeah, I'm just I'm just taking in the view. Okay, there we go. I have the commander, and I'm putting down. Uh, it's gonna be full vehicles on this planet. Well, maybe we should do some. Uh, okay, we have three orbital fabers. I'm gonna put down an anchor. Okay, and now I'm gonna start making some fabers. Put more uh, commanders through, man. Yeah, they're going through. Okay, and then... Okay. I'm shutting it off. Okay. Okay, you... you okay, great. We got a bunch of stuff. Um... Okay, uh, now you have, you can see here, Gojiro, you have a tank. So uh, you can take the, uh, the military units and just uh, go around the planet and see if we're alone. Alright. Uh, uh, I guess don't worry about the original planet right now? Yeah, no, don't worry about it. Or you're okay. here now. Okay. God damn it. Why is the energy crashing? Oh. Okay, I got an economy up and running, so that's good. Okay, the guy who disconnected reconnected, so he's not dropping out. Um Make sure you're not making any... You know what? Turn off the orbital factory, uh, Rico, because uh, I need the energy. Alright. We don't have the resources now for an orbital... Uh... Okay, okay. Uh... On this planet? Uh, nope. On the original planet. I think it's a satellite. Uh... 
Okay. Now that you see satellite, I remember I have to make a radar. I have a lot of factories uh, with um, combat units waiting for you, Kojiro. You'll see them. Yeah, I'm trying to just make everything move. Just planning out uh, routes. I just need to know if we're alone here, and if we're not, I need to know where they are. Right. Uh, have. Uh, I guess I should make an air factory too, and then you can uh, scout easily. Yeah, that would be great. Okay, okay, now we have a big economy, so... I'm gonna start... an orbital factory. And you know where exa uh, particularly I would like you to go? I would like you to go, uh, here. To tell me if the catalyst uh, points, you can see the little catalyst points, that's where you built the annihilator. Yeah. They're free. Okay. I'll park some units over there. Okay, economy's crashing because I'm going orbital even though I only have uh, T1, but whatever. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna power through it. We go big or go home. Yep. Yeah, it's crashing hard, but it shouldn't be long now. You know what, though, man? You have uh, I have four Avengers. They are the orbital units. You can see them here. These are hmm. orbital space. They are fighter orbital fighters, and they can move really fast, though they All cannot right. see very much on the ground. So you can move them around. Yeah, I'll probably try to split them. Yeah. And you have lots of units waiting for you here. And here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, grabbing units. How's it going out there, uh, Rico? It's going all right. Uh, nobody's really attacking me at the moment. And now you have an aircraft factory here that's gonna provide you with fighters and some scout aircraft. Okay. I just want to know if the planet is empty. Okay, now we have the orbital factory. I'm gonna make a uh, advanced radar satellite, and then you can move this, and you can see a lot on the planet. Awesome. Well, it does look like we're alone up here. Nice. Uh, I mean, yeah, I haven't seen anyone. And Recall does have a decent base down there, so the thing is I cannot send him ships, you see, through the teleport. You can only send him to ground units, and mm. they're not very helpful for him right now. Although with a good economy, he could build up quickly, and we do have a... Well, we're, we're getting there with a good economy. Let me see, okay, um... Okay, I can see some, uh, yeah, somebody arrived on this planet, uh, where, I don't on, on, in space, uh, he will have a, uh, oh, I see, and he uh, will try to build a teleport, a teleport on the ground, if you see a teleport on the ground, you have to destroy it as quickly as possible, yeah, so basically, take your units, the ground units, and uh, put them in little bunches all around the planet, so that you have vision everywhere at all times, so the moment that, uh, you see, you want, you don't want, you want to clear up the fog of war, Oh, see, yeah. I made, the, I made the advanced radar satellite, it's right here, you can see it, and I'm gonna make another one, so one of them should be on one side of the planet, the other should be on the other side, and uh, right. supported by the Avengers, the, uh, the the spacecraft, Yep. and then um, and then we should be yeah, able to see everything. Coming in slowly, trying to get everything into position. Okay, now I'm building a bunch of 
air factories. I, uh, I'm gonna build some air units. And I'm gonna build some bombers so that if we do see a portal coming up, you can just take the bombers uh, swarm and just destroy them. Okay. Energy depleted. Yeah, I'm gonna fix that. I'm gonna work on that. Okay, you can see them right yeah, here. Uh, this orbital. F you have to take that down with your uh, Avengers. Uh, Avengers you are the Avengers of the spacecraft, and yeah. you have to go on the ground. And if you see a portal, destroy the portal. This guy's gonna try to make a portal right underneath you. He hasn't made yeah. one yet, so just put some yeah. units. If he moves around, look, there's another one right here from the white guy. Can you see? Yep. He's making a portal right there. You have to take that down. Yeah. Yeah. I'm out for it. Okay. Uh. Uh. And anyway, I have planes. I have planes. I'm gonna send them there. Forces taking fire. Shit. Uh, somebody's what? moving in on me. Yeah, you're gonna take down the white guy. I think you took down the blue guy. Yeah. Uh, I think I have another uh, radar satellite. Let me see. Yeah. Okay, energy's crashing. Uh, Gotta spread out units. Uh, Rico, are you uh, building a lot of shit? What are you doing? No, I'm getting destroyed right now. Getting destroyed. If it's hopeless, uh, we could use you here. Yeah, it's gonna be hopeless. I don't know why the economy is crashing so hard. I'm not building that much. All right, I'm going over there. Okay, uh, I stopped the orbital factory because I don't. You know have why energy I being I built. I, I'm. Bu I have two uh, commanders building uh, rows of energy, but it's T1, and uh, I want to make. I'm gonna make a T2 vehicle factory. And try to get some T2 fabrics to make T2 energy. That's. Orbital factory destroyed. Uh, not ours. That oh, was the yeah, other one. That was yours. We need to get energy back. And then we need to get started on the catalyst. Yeah. Um. Yeah, first the energy, and to do the energy, I have to finish the T2 um, vehicle factory. Uh, I see some idle commanders. I'm gonna have them build energy. Yeah, uh, they were building energy before, and I, th I guess they stopped, so. Um, <coughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, shoot. Some units <laughs> here are. Uh, What's wrong? Here. They're um, they're not moving. Oh, uh, they're they're bunched up. Yeah. Okay. I'll try to. F Doesn't Come seem on. There's nothing I can do about it. So I'm gonna build the T2 factory on the other side of the planet. Okay. I'm gonna get these units fixed. If you can get it fixed, I'll be good. I would help. Yeah. Uh, Rico, when you're building the energy, try not to build too close to the mechs because then we cannot upgrade the mechs. You know about that, right? Yeah. Okay, and uh, Kojiro needs to make sure he has bunches of units like he does all over the planet, so whenever they yeah. try to land... Yeah, I gotta get back to throwing them everywhere. Uh, let's see. You can put them on patrol, uh, you hit P for patrol, okay. and then you select an area and then they go around that area, but if you put a, you can put them on planet-wide patrol, so if you, if you click P and select the entire planet, uh, they just go around the planet, but that's uh, stressful for the server. Uh, so I got it. Unless uh, it's very good tactic, but unless you really need it, don't do it. Okay, I'm gonna put down some patrols then. Put down some just to to check how it works, basically. But don't put them on planet wide, and don't yeah. put too many of them. Okay. Okay. okay we, we have the advanced factory. Uh, get T2 going. I'll get T2 fabers out and. Uh, 
and what else then? Uh, do we need uh, do we need more T2 units? I guess I'm gonna put down a row of T2 factories, like let's say three of them. And uh, well, now that we have the economy, I should switch back on the orbital factory if I can find it. Uh, okay. Okay, I found it, and it's making. Okay, it's making. Uh, What's I'm gonna call it? Defenders, and I'm gonna also put it to make some. Uh, oh my gosh, the orbital battleship. Oh wait, but that's an that's it. Is that a battleship or is that? Yeah, that's a battleship. It's not a Titan. So I'm gonna make it like every seven defenders make a battleship. Every ten defenders. All right, I gotta start organizing some of these armies. I've okay. Uh, control one. Okay, we don't yet have the economy to go for the uh, to start building the thing. You know what? I think we should not start building the um, the catalyst because the other players are gonna get a. Um... Yeah, we need a we need to get an army of fabers first and make sure our economy is super stable. Exactly. So okay, I'm making out T2 energy with one of the fabers. And then uh, we have a lot of metal. The metal is not the problem right now. And then you set up. Uh, okay, set this up. No. Wouldn't be a bad idea to. Uh, I don't oh, know. someone's oh, incoming. Oh, yep, they're coming. Uh, you can take him down. Yeah. Use the Avengers. Or. No, uh, yeah, he he took down the uh, the. Fa there's just a portal down, so... Yeah, it's just a portal. Is somebody building an Omega? Am I building an Omega? Yeah, there's one in an orbital factory. Oh yeah, I'm making one. Yeah, I'm making one for every 10... Uh, I don't know. I think we would need it if they send a lot of... They could send a huge swarm of Avengers. Alright, well, uh, I'm gonna priori prioritize it then. We need, more, we need more Avengers, so we need a few more orbital factories because... Okay, look at this freaking energy. Okay, um, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm also gonna put down some uh, some storage. And you build some air factories, so I'm gonna put them to make uh, bombers. But I don't know. There's these fighters that can fly in space and. Uh, and on the atmosphere? Yeah, we'll need uh, a gun mix uh, both. Okay. Um, I have a ton of energy now. What should I make? Uh, we need to prioritize Annihilator. <laughs> okay, well... We but should I make uh, a couple of Ares, maybe? Um, Just in case. You know might, what? We uh, we could start right now. Let's start right now. The annihilator, then. Yeah. Okay. We just, we just need an army of fabers. Catalyst. Okay. I started with uh, a bunch of fabers. We uh, we have an army. I'm making. Uh, I'm making a bunch of them. Let me see. I'm just gonna keep putting down the. It's gonna get crowded up here. <laughs> and, yeah. and when you want to move units uh, from one side of the planet to the other, it will be. Impossible. So you you want to have good units everywhere, so that whenever they try to land, yeah, uh, the I mechanics see. of locking a planet down are complex because there's so many ways to invade it. Yeah. So it's interesting. Uh, your units can go into the ridges of this planet or something. Uh. Yeah. Well, I'm just looking at some so. of the some of the pathing. I don't think so. Yeah. Well, actually. There might be ramps that you go down. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's like the middle of the planet. There's like ramps you can. I've seen you, units going in and out of them. Okay. And there's some people who you know they they micromanage them and they put you know their artillery or whatever and. Mm, well, I have no. no idea how this shit works. Uh, do we have T2 bots going up? Uh, no, I'm making T2 vehicles. Only T2 vehicles. Um, we need to get them closer to the catalyst points. 
Has the catalyst started? Uh, I, I've, I've sent no, they haven't started. I've sent some fabbers, but I've no idea where they are now. Um, in any case, because we're wasting um, resources, I'm just gonna put up a few more orbital factories. I don't think there's been a commander death yet. No. Do we even know what's going on in the red planet? We don't know. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. We're just They're worried about there. getting annihilators up. I can say one thing though. In the white planet, the orbital presence is, is laughable. Mm. For this stage of the game. Oh Jesus, we're wasting so many resources right now. Um. Okay, let me see what I can make. Well, you know what I can make? Freaking nukes. <laughs> I'm starting a nuke. And then they, you can fire them from planet to planet. Uh. Okay, so we got a nuke coming up here. Alright. Uh, I'm making some more little factories. I think this game is ours to lose. Hmm. If we can, yeah. Uh, well, uh, okay. Let me see. I have a bunch of fibers now on the pole, uh, but they're T21 one fibers and they cannot start a catalyst. Um, are there any T2 fibers on the way? I sent some. I sent one or two, but you know, Recall, maybe you stop them and give them another order? Maybe. Um, I've just been using the ones on the outskirts. Now I can see you have a nerve fiber here, and you're making a T2 air factory. Uh, Angel, support platform, repairs nearby units. I've never heard of this uh, unit before. Never heard of it. That's weird. I mean, I have a factory just making T2 fibers, but it's on the other side of the planet. It might even be a good idea to just freaking... Yeah, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna build a fucking uh, teleporter, man. Okay, and now the nuke is at two percent. I can rush it, and I might as well rush it since mm. we're wasting resources. Uh, I wonder if we could have anti nukes, but there's no point because these guys do not know what we have on the ground. Where are they going to throw the? Mm. Okay. Well, they know I'm where the catalysts are. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's true. Okay, so we can make around the catalyst sand in nukes, I guess. Um, okay, I made a portal. Can you make a portal on the North Pole? Uh, yeah. So I can send T2 fabric through. When it's ready, ping it. Kraken's missile attack. I have no idea what a Kraken is. I don't think there's such a unit. The nuke is at 56%. Uh, and since yeah, we're still wasting a, energy. What? Keep a lookout for workers. I keep having to fix them. They're stuck in the ridges. Yeah, yeah. It's, um. Yeah, but we have a lot of units. Yeah. Okay, portal's ready. Okay. Okay. And now if I can only find... Okay. I'm putting through three... Um, level uh, two fibers and... Keep that portal open because I've connected it to the T2 factory that makes the fat T2 fibers. And start the catalyst when you can. I'm making a second nuke. If you make anti nukes up there. Okay, we have a nuke ready. I'm gonna keep it until we have a few and then we can, like. We'll see what we're gonna do with it. I'm just gonna keep putting down nukes as, as long as we have uh, the economy for it. Are we even upgrading our metal to level 2? Oh, uh, unit cannon. 
Here. What? Uh, that's a cannon that fires units. Oh. So now we have, but you're gonna destroy them. Oh, jeez, yeah. You see it? It's a yeah. cannon that fires units, it can fire units from planet to planet or on the same planet. Huh. So they send a, a T2 bots and a Faber to make the, t the portal, but... Didn't work. Mm. They're gonna team up on us, but if they're doing... Where? Oh, okay. So you know what they're doing? They're trying to build Halley's on the, on the red planet. And oh, wait, we got a bunch of... What? They're coming back? Oh, uh, those are planes. Okay. How do these planes... Are these the space planes? I have no idea. Uh, uh, they're okay. T2. Uh, they're probably space planes. Okay. Uh, uh, where we have 136 it? planes, and I selected all of them, and I'm sending them there. They're not going to make any damage. They're just attacking our... Look, all the planes are c converging there because I sent them. We've had 136, yeah. and we destroyed yeah. them. Look, that's it. Game over. And now I'm going <laughs> to put them... I'm going to put them on patrol the entire planet, those planes. So you'll okay. see them patrolling. Yeah. Okay. You know how uh, you choose one plane, and then you go to the left of the screen and you double click on its image and you select all the planes in the entire solar system. Oh, okay. Pick one plane, and then yeah. double click to the left, uh, the bottom left side of the screen on its icon. Any unit. Yeah, I you see. Like all that's, the units. That's everything. Unfortunately, oh. it's not all the units on the planet. It's all the units in the entire solar system. Mm. So, but the thing is, <coughs> the planes cannot change planets, so it, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Or maybe they fixed it, at least that's the last time that I played, like two years ago, so maybe they fixed that. And you can see now on the red planet, they're trying to build the thrusters uh, right here. To uh -huh. smash, if they build six thrusters, they can smash the planet on another planet. But if they are on it too, they're going to die. Whereas our planet is better because we don't have to smash our planet, it fires a laser. Right. So I think, I don't think they're... The most they can do is they can take us down and then... Okay, you know what? If they also have presence on the on the white planet, then they can keep their commanders on the white planet and then smash the other planet on us, and that takes us down. Hmm. Uh, so the thing is, can we make our catalysts faster than those guys can smash their moon on us, their their planet on us? Okay, we have one catalyst, so we need uh, one, two, three, four more. Haley located. Um, yeah, we have the resources. Uh, I'm sending you. You have loads of um, fabrics waiting for you, Rico. I'm gonna. I'm gonna set the next catalyst. I yeah, see a bunch of fabrics. That they're can. just sitting. They're not moving. I'm gonna have to like move them myself. No, they're not moving mm. when I click on the catalyst. I have to move them by hand. Okay, um, let me see what the economy is doing. Now it's crashing, so... I'm gonna make some T2 um, energy. Oh shit! Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's a, it's a, it's a rush now. It's a, it's a race. Uh. uh you know what? Uh, I'm su shutting down. Uh, Rico, start shutting down factories. All right. Turning power in them off. And then we're gonna uh, turn on the the ones that we need more only. We don't need any more units. All the T1 yeah. factories have to stop. Uh, and you have T2 factories being uh, made. Yeah, air, air factories. And keep those on. No, I turn them off. If you want, some of them turn them on again. But look, the the energy is crashing. Um, we definitely do not need more units right now. Yeah, uh. uh, they're gonna get them up. And I guess they're gonna go for our planet, right? Yeah. What else? Are, where else are they gonna go? Well, you never know. You never know. Uh, I mean, they probably will, but <laughs> uh, we got incoming. I think. Uh, yeah, they're landing. 
if you zoom out. The, oh, okay, they sent some planes here, but they can't do much. Oh, okay, okay. They took out, I'm gonna, they took out our... Uh, I'm gonna get them. Yeah. I'm gonna get them. I have all these planes. Yeah, I got them. Uh, look at Orbital. There's a lot incoming. There is, huh? Yeah. Uh, what What is it exactly? Uh, uh, you know what I think it is? I think it's uh, unit cannons again. So I think it looks like two or three unit cannons. So uh, they cannot beat us with that. We have so many units. They cannot. They're yeah, sending it's a unit cannon. <laughs> yeah, oh, they're T two, two units. There. Okay. Um, That's the problem. I'm sending. I'm sending all the bombers there. Okay, they cannot beat us. They they just can uh, delay us. That's what they're doing. They delay us. So I'm sending all the bombers now. Look. Uh, there's still another one coming our way, orbital. Yeah, they're just gonna hit us since we have this. That's gonna keep. We going. don't have. We don't have Rickle, the Rickle, you have the economy now. You have the. Try to rush on some catalysts. I'm trying to, but they're targeting. Uh, I have, I have no idea what this is that's incoming. Uh, it's a nuke. Yeah, they're, yeah, gonna they're, hit they're one. sending everything they have. <laughs> yeah, it's going on the catalyst and yeah. it's yeah. down. It's gone. Oh, okay. We're do we're lo we lost. <laughs> GG. <laughs> the the plan is coming for us. If you want, you can zoom out and you can see it smash. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but it's gonna take a long time though. Uh, <laughs> Maybe we. You want to teleport? <laughs> uh, uh, we're dead anyway. Yeah. Yeah. The only if, thing if we, we could if, do is try to were, rush the catalyst at this point the Gallus, but and if try we, to shoot if, it. If we had been um, better at multitasking, we could have tried to like uh, get a foothold on uh, the w the w white planet again. Because mm. if we go back there, uh, nothing there. Really really. Yeah, there's nothing there. Nothing, I mean, I, you cannot see the ground. You can see only space, but. Yeah. You can tell by space that there's not, there's probably not much. Well, we'll know soon, I guess. Yeah, and another nuke now. Anyway, I'm happy because we came much closer to victory than the last two games, so. I mean, look at this planet. We have all this stuff, we just didn't know how to uh, leverage mm. it correctly. Yeah. And maybe it was a mistake even starting to make the catalyst because they get notifications, you see, when you start making it. So if mm. you, first you have to build the economy so that you can make it in like two minutes when you start making it. Because if you're going to take 20 minutes, then they're gonna, you're going to give them time to... I see. Hmm. Look the nukes. Yeah, if you look here, you can see the uh, how many th uh, five thrusters. So yep. I think uh, I designed the system. So I said five thrusters, but I could I, I could make it seven for next time. So look, it was the second team that beat us, right? The team, the team I told you is gonna beat us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, now you can see the red planet. The other guys didn't even wait to see the, the smash. Mm. And now they're invading with, uh, what are these units? They're orbitals. Oh, yeah. They're invading with those orbital battleships, like I told you, see? So when those come, I don't think you can take them down with, uh, with just Avengers, you know? Look at it. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's enough for today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait though, I'd like to see how much shit they had. 
At least on the white planet. Okay. Yeah, they had a lot of shit. Look at the white planet. Yeah. And they don't seem to have anything on patrol, so they're all must up. They're all like nice, tidy units. Mm. And uh, the server's doing fine. Yeah, it looked like it's it kept it. Yeah, at 100 sim speed the whole time. It's it's the expensive one too. I wonder if we played uh, with a cheaper one, how much worse it would be, but it's half price. But but anyway, we already stressed the uh, the expensive one once. In the second game, I think you said it was 60% or something, so... Yeah. Alright, now I'm gonna shut it down. Okay, and let me know what the damage is. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was 20 bucks yesterday. 20 yesterday? What do you mean? We didn't play yesterday. Uh, cause I was setting it up. That took me a while. And you spent 20? <laughs> yeah, I accidentally, I accidentally, uh, I forgot about terminating each instance. Oh. So oh, it, it, it went up a little bit. Hmm. Well, 20 is not a little bit, man. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, we didn't even play it, man. We should, you should have, uh, you should have the, uh... oh, whatever, it doesn't matter. Alright, I'm cutting the stream. It.